Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Yu-Gi-Oh! It's me, Cooper, and today we are going to be going on out and we are going to be buying some cards. Luckily, we own a lot of Domino City now. There are still a few places under attack, but, you know, we're doing okay. Not great, but okay. Uh, we're gonna go ahead and we're just gonna check out any cards around here, see if there's anything good. Hopefully, we're starting to get go God Orgoth. Oh, it's Orgoth the Destroyer. That's funny. Uh, Barrel Dragon. Yeah, that's some good cards. It's good to keep track of everything just to make sure you're uh, seeing the good stuff. Yeah, there's a lot of good stuff in this game. Um, out of all of these cards, I would say not any of them are currently of use to us. Maybe you. You might become useful to us. Um, and if not you, it would have to be someone else in here. I just can't tell who. Eh, most of these cards are okay. Well, we'll have to make do with what we got. I don't really like a lot of these. Too weak, too useless, too nothing. Final Destiny is too risky. Dark Hole is nice, but we already have the maximum amount. Trap cards, we just can't find any more. Yeah, okay. Well, we make do with what we got. We got one new card. Um, just in case, let me get a duel with you. Okay. Yeah, let's get a fun little duel with the monkey guy. How are you doing? Uh, let's go by quantity, and I'm running out of cards. Oh crap, maybe I should buy some. Exarion Universe will do a lot of damage to me. Damn, that's a really powerful card to summon on the first turn. Um, luckily, I do have trap cards, and I could get my monster out. But I have no tributes yet. Hopefully in time I'll get them. Tribute summon, but it is dead. Oh, it was one of the swamp guys. Swamp Battle Guard or Lava Battle Guard. That's cool. Uh, we'll summon your Dragon Scroll. Frog the Jam, you go die. Nope, Frog the Jam is bait. And we're just going to keep attacking until we get a Tribute Monster. We run quite a few, or an Evolution card. Evolution would be really good. All-Purpose Landmine, otherwise known as Widespread Ruin. There we go. Hey, I was just talking about you. Yamada Dragon Scroll becomes the Metal Dragon. And now we just attack with everybody. Unless my opponent has a water monster, we're in a really good spot. I left them with basically nothing. So what are you going to do about it? Not a water monster, but there is a trap card, so... I have to have some fear when I do the next attack. Zone Eater, go in. Okay, just risk your life points to make sure the trap card can't kill Metal Dragon. And then we just go for some damage. Next turn we have game. Wanted it to be this turn, but we didn't really draw a strong enough monster. Barrel Lily. In fact, I think that's weak to me. Yep, it's weak to Metal Dragon. So that is the end of the duel. Let's go ahead and do it. Metal Dragon goes in. Barrel Lily goes away. And Giant Germ ends the duel. Victory goes to us. We got a good deck uh, uh, capacity increase. Laser Armor Cannon. Yeah, yeah. It uh, works for insect, shelled, or beam attack monsters. Ah, that's cool. Okay. I I'm sorry, it's adorable. You're an adorable creature, you know that? I'm gonna go heal, though, because you kind of messed me up slightly. Just slightly. So, we are gonna make some slight edits to our deck to make sure it's a little more or less consistent, because I'm not exactly sure of what I really intend to do. Cyber Soldier's nice, Gigabyte is nice, you're fine, you're fine, you are great. All of these cards are quite good. But some of them need to be dropped. So who is in the way? Which of these cards is just purely in the way? Every one of these has some form of use. I would drop one of these. And I guess I can add something decent, right? It's a little... Actually, no, it's kind of expensive. Okay. I can add something okay. Like, if I wanted to add that new Spirit of the Books, it'd probably be a 0% chance, right? Yeah, no chance. But we can add something like Hyena, right? No, we can't. Okay. Well, that's okay, because we can add uh, a Little D. <laughs> little D would evolve with Metamorph, right? That's 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 a fact. Uh, let's see if we can find something bigger. Something that might evolve with Metamorph. Gradius? Do you think Gradius would Metamorph? Maybe? Maybe. There's a chance. I just don't know if it's worth it. But it's the cheapest thing I can go for. You know what? We're going to use a little Duke Devlin in our deck, and we're going to see if that Gradius transforms. I'm just kind of curious, because this game has a lot of interesting transformations. Let's do another tra uh, training duel, just by uh, getting...
getting some experience. Uh, you are good to bet, Demon Beavers. Uh, you're good with Doron. Going first is really helpful. This may not be our best field to be on, but we'll, we'll be fine. We will not be fine. They started Dark Hole. God damn it. You guys already know I hate the Dark Hole. Mystic Tomato, and they got Pot of Greed. Damn. Mystic Tomato, Dark Hole, Pot of Greed. I hate that they have a trap card, so I can't just safely go in. Fiend beats Dream, I believe. Dream beats Shadow, so... Let's just go for it and pray. Oh, they have freaking Widespread Ruin! Oh my gosh. And Hungry Burger, which is a, a freaking Divine Monster. Forcing out my, my spell card. I need to save my Dragon Scroll, so we will Sinister Serpent, despite the life to our uh, life points. Yeah, despite the risk to our life points, I should say. Let's see how Gold Goyal does. Weak to Fiend, and I just drew a Fiend. Lucky me. Granted, it's a Fiend that would rather multiply than attack, so... I think I will do... Well, if he tributes, I'll, you know, I'm not going to let him tribute. It sucks that I didn't get to multiply, but screw it. As long as he's not tributing, I'm happy. Crap. Yeah, I still have my tribute monster, though. A shadow monster. A lot harder to kill. I don't have a dream monster. Bear Trap doesn't even kill it, so let's just play a little defensively and hope for the best. Bear Trap gets rid of the Dark World Thorns, and Sinister Serpent, it's like I lost nothing this turn. No tribute still, and I just got our Sister Serpent, which is not great. Ah, uh, not great, not great. Alright, let's just play it, I don't care. Yep, I need my tributes. I run quite a few, I just need to draw one of them. Okay, I cannot defeat that monster because it's of the forest. I can get Metal Morph, so that can get me my dragon. That's pretty good, but it will cost me to do so. Hopefully, I'll have time. No tribute? Okay. No big monster that can just beat me up? Nope, just more of those things. Okay. Or I can attempt Gradius. God damn it. I do want to know about Gradius, but let's go for the guarantee right now. Well, you know what? This is a training duel. Let's do it. It does work. Metal Morph on Gradius creates... The fuck? Hello? A killing machine that came from across the far reaches of space. It can call an invader from another dimension. Alright. Interesting. Okay. So if I need a, a dream... It's a dream monster. And if I need a multiplying dream monster, there we go. And the invader is a fiend. So that actually works out really well for us. Forest. Damn it. Damn it. Oh, Mushroom Man! And all of these cards are getting buffed now. Oh, that is the worst. Now I need Metal Morph again. Hot Agreed saved me. I should have just went for the Pyro Monster. He beats everything, but I wanted to know. Okay, it can power up itself by drawing on all plants on the own field. Yep, that would do it. Let's get Pot Agreed and pray to God for the best. Got it. Wow, what a top deck. I turn from Wind, which is weak to them, into... Fire. Metal Dragon's Pyro. Yeah, let's get rid of this to stop them from getting buffed. And then you go into defense mode, and I pray to God they don't tribute. Or have a water monster. That's good. That's good. Okay, just keep coming back. You're my little buddy. You're my little buddy. You're my little guy. You're my little pal. All right, we're just going to keep destroying monsters until they tribute. But hopefully when they tribute, we'll hit them with our Amazonist Archer. Okay, we hit something. Arlen Way is the thing that survives. I could get another Metal Morph at the risk of my life points. And I do have enough life points left to do it. As long as they do not tribute. Okay. Now, I am too curious not to. Okay, doesn't work. I tried. Uh, let's just go ahead and destroy... Yeah, Arlen Way. This guy seems to be a force deck, and let's hope to god I don't die. Double Jern's powered up a monster. He could try to kill me. Oh, whoa. You powered up which monster exactly? Oh, that card's a shadow card. Uh-oh. Soul of Purity and Light. It's your time to shine. I have to get rid of that shadow card, but I'm happy to have you. Tribute. Now I'll show you some effects. Oh yeah, you buff yourself and I nerf you. This is the world we live in. Your buff is gone now. You have zero attack points. Ooh, that felt good. Okay, 
Turning it around in the late game, folks. Yep, they just had another one. Damn. It was nice while it lasted, though. Um, most likely, I'm not going to be able to um, do much. Cyber Commander could probably evolve. Let's see it. Metal Morph makes it into a Gadget Soldier. I already knew that, but still. Gadget Soldier's really good. Both cards would have been good. Giant Germ's just trying to stall. I can respect it. I don't like it, but I can respect it. Tomozaurus. Oh my god. Unless... You do go again! Jinzo! Oh my god! Cyber Soldier's really good! Cyber Soldier is really good and important for the deck. That won us the duel. Getting rid of the opponent's trap and doing all of this. Oh man, what a duel. A fiend monster that we don't need. Beat him. Yeah, he'll just come back. Doesn't matter. I was doing that for training, but it turns out the training is complete. Now that I think about it, do I have any cards that work into Jinzo? Well, let's check out our deck. We got machines, so a gadget soldier can become a Jinzo. Can anything else? Like, we already know Tomazor, so let's knock them out. Let's see if there's any cheap monsters like Cyber Commander that can maybe help me get more Jinzo possibilities. Because Jinzo would just be super helpful against these annoying characters. Okay, we're going to go all the way down to our 500-point monsters because they're the cheapest things we can afford. Yeah, let's, let's go take a peek. We're almost there. 500 points. Here we come. Trapmaster. Jinzo number... Mm, it's not called Jinzo in this game, but maybe. We'll try an Android 7. Well, it might work. It might not. All right, let's go out and let's actually continue what we're supposed to be doing. We went everywhere, but I believe the Galapagos. No Mako Tsunami. Oh, no. No anybody. What the hell? <gasps> Strings! S say something. W what a strained individual. I've never felt so uncomfortable. Uh, you all right there, Mako? Everything, everything cool? Hey, you come just at the right time. Can you do something about this person? I lack the skill to deal with such weirdness. Leave it to me. All right, Strings. You versus me. A boss fight for the ages. I'll give you a launcher spider if you win. Ooh, advantage goes to... Okay, we get to go first, but field advantage goes to them. So we, we don't know if our tribute monster will be strong enough. Okay, Dark Droid has a permanent effect. Oh, no. It's a nerfing effect. Oh, shit. All right, well, we could try to Metal Morph Spike Bot and see if it makes something strong enough. It's our only hope, really. I don't have a Thunder Monster after all. Okay, I can Metal Morph Spike Bot, and it is strong enough. Okay, it was worth it. There we go. Our upgrading is working. And I'm not nerfed anymore, so that's good news. Hot agreed. That's really bad news. Okay, weird. They didn't do anything else. Color Serpent returns to help me get more monsters onto the field. I want to do as much damage as I can before they decide to just defeat us. Um, let's attack with our strongest just to be safe. Okay, they have a water monster, weirdly enough. High Tide Gyojin. Demon Beast King. No! That's why I did as much damage as I could before something stupid like that happened. Oh, I hate it. I hate it so much. I can get a really strong monster, though. It'll be water. Another demon. You know what? That was a waste. That one was a waste. I take it. Another pot of greed. Oh, my gosh. A trap card scares me. Okay, they got me now. A trap card scares me enough to not. Oh, I didn't do it. Okay. Back in. Okay, no, it was worth it. It was worth not doing it. That has way too much attack and is only weak to fiend. Which I have. Yeah! <laughs> Lucky me. But we're... Sa okay. We have a 2450 transformation, which could beat anything. But we're saving it for an emergency in case they have spells and traps. We have a Metal Dragon for grass, and we have a Cyber Source. And a Gadget Soldier, but he's dead. See common. So we're not using the Pyro one in this, in this game. No way in hell. The Giant Germs will be nice for later. We're just going to go all the way. We're going to our perfect form. 24. Oh, we're a fiend, not a water. I was misremembering uh, things. Whoops. My bad. Revival Slime? Okay. Okay. 
I do need to deal with those, and there is a trap card, so I need to bait out the trap. Um, I want to use Giant Germ, I just can't, so let's bait out the trap. And there was no trap, but I had to be safe. I had to be sure. I'm very scared, guys, because they are trying to tribute on me. Oh, that's interesting. That's what the card was. He's trying to set up for a big tribute. You can feel it. He has a new trap, making me not want to do it again, which is annoying, but it is okay. Um, Again, what are my life points at? Pretty good. Bait out the trap is probably our best bet. I was right. No, it's Toriental! Oh, it was a mirror four, so there was nothing I could do. Okay, I have to Dark Hole. We're at a really big disadvantage now. That puts us at a huge disadvantage. And that's worse. Oh, God. Oh, dear God. Oh, Gradius can become useless. Gradius would not be strong enough. You're my best chance. And you're going to have zero attack, and I pray that they tribute. I pray that my opponent tributes. Yes! Yes, they tribute for a Roaring Ocean Sea Snake. Okay, they have a trap, which doesn't matter unless it's a Toriental, which honestly attack. Yep, it was. They have more than one. And that is busted. That is busted that they had more than one of those. I could multiply and still attack, which is pretty good. And then get a Metal Morph for later. So you know what? Even though I don't think you become a machine when you... Yeah, you do. Okay. Yeah, we can multiply into something that likes this territory and do some damage. That way we get two monsters out of the deal and I can still use other cards. He's bricked. Oh my god. We're actually doing well against strings. That feels so good. Um, I could try to Metamorph just to see if this thing evolves again. Or I have 13 plus 12 is 15. 3,000 damage. It's not enough to win the duel. So I might as well try to evolve again just to practice what my deck can do. Damn it. That's as far as they go. Okay. Well, at least we know I can create a multiplier, which is really handy. And the fact that it beats um, Shadow is nice. Dreams are not easy to come by. Worm Drake makes sense. Your water deck always made sense. I have a Wind Monster. I have a Beckon. I have Game. I'm ending this duel. Yeah, I'm ending this duel. Metal Dragon Go. Oh, that felt so good. Defeating Strings. One try. 45 increase. A thousand... Yeah! Revival Slime. I'm just not going to be able to use that card anytime soon, but it's a good card. Yes, thank you. But what brings you here? I need your help, Mako. I see. What a horrible situation. This is why I've been sensing trouble among the waves. My instincts tell me something more sinister is in the works. You're right. Anyways, I'm going to the town of Domino. I will protect it with my life. Let's go find another ally. Oh, that's a lot of them. We have found quite a few allies. But maybe there is still one left. Because there are two territories in Domino that were taken over. But I'm very curious to see which territory uh, our buddy Mako is protecting. First things first, though. We got really messed up in that duel with strings. We just had a good duel against them, luckily. I'm glad I hit that Toriental tree. The fact that he got two of those is busted. So this area is still the, under control. Mai has this one. Rex has this one. Bones has this one. And Mako took bottom left. So that means we just need one more person and we completely take back Domino. Which is a good idea. We'll get to that point in a second, though. Let us do some training. Hey there, Mako. Let's, uh, let's train. Yeah, I was getting bored of the Neo goals. They must keep coming, and he just has to keep fighting them off. I appreciate your help, sir. Okay, he's going first, which is terrible for me, especially when he has all of that nonsense going on. Um, no way in hell I can kill that card. I can stall it to let me get a tribute monster. But I have to pray, I pray to God to get a tribute, and I have to get past those trap cards. And knowing him, he's known for his, uh, electric lizard just there to paralyze me. It don't matter. Okay, Beckon is what we were looking for. So he's known for Toriental Tribute, so I'm only going to use Magical Scientist just in case. Good. He has no traps, apparently. That surprises me more than anything. Heavy Storm, the Board Wiper. We lost every single card we owned. That is heartbreaking. And no matter what play I make, we're going to lose more. I can't let him Tribute, but I only have a Beauty Lip and a Dark Hole. 
It's a top deck game, but he has a way bigger hand than me. Because he just played one spell to end it all. Oh, it's a shadow monster. Whatever he just played was a shadow monster. Oh, his mom lets him have two zone eaters. All right, well, that sucks. It's all up to the top deck game. Oh, at least I got rid of the Demon Beast King of the Marshland. And top deck game is doing its best. I should have just saved that. It's fine, though. I guess I'm preventing tributing. Oh, wow, that's one of my best cards. He's going to have a trouble beating. That is my best card that I can just summon. Yep, he's going to have trouble beating this. Penguin Knight's in trouble. We have a trap card, and we're just going to play it safe. See, he's not as good when he doesn't have the ocean at his back. Playing against him earlier when he had the ocean backing him up, it was a little too much. So this time he can get a tribute monster, but I have the traps I need to protect myself. Leviathan makes it water. Yikes. Kairushin is scary, but I can nerf it. Which isn't enough, but it will have to do for now. Archery takes down a monster's power to the point where I could beat it, and Aqua Serpent's gone. Alright, Gigabyte, you are strong enough now. Sinister Serpent, let's get out there. My Reptile goes ham. My attack points are going ham. I feel full control of this duel. I'm having a good duel. We don't care about being Kraken. Cool card, just not going to do anything to us. Especially when I can just get my monster back. Now I call upon the power of the wind, and we're going to start ripping him apart. This power down effect of Mammoth Graveyard is just super handy. Alright, next turn I got him. Guaranteed with Dark Hole, pretty much. No, not really, but it's, it's there. Enchanting Mermaid, just getting buffed by the field, saving her. Oh yeah, my Toadmaster, you're going down. And just end this fight. Alright, Mammoth Graveyard, super handy card, saving our day. Getting a nice 12 point increase, Jormungandr's terrible, I don't even want it. <laughs> Looks at card, I don't want it. Thanks for nothing, Mako. Uh, guys, that is going to be it for this episode. We had a very successful episode, in my opinion, and I had a lot of fun today. So, please remember to like and subscribe, and hopefully, whoever's left for us to save, they'll willingly come with us and we don't have to fight another creeper like strings. Bye bye <laughs>